Family, friends, and fellow law enforcement officers paid final tribute today to a fallen Carroll County deputy. Deputy Noah Rainey, who died in a crash last week, was laid to rest this afternoon. Our Logan Gay shares how family honored him. The family of Carroll County Sheriff Deputy Noah Rainey laid him to rest today. During his funeral, they talked about what they'll miss most and what he meant to the community here. It was an emotional day for neighbors in Carroll County. Family, friends, and colleagues of Noah Rainey said their final goodbyes Sunday inside a packed high school gym in Delphi. We never want to give up someone that means, that means so much to us. The tragic crash left his family with so many questions. I know the scripture says all things work for good for those who love the Lord and call according to his purpose. But right now, it's difficult to understand what good can come of this. Law enforcement from neighboring communities showed up in large numbers to show support for his family and honor his legacy, something the family says has given them strength to keep going. If I had known how many people care for Noah and had his back, I never would have worried as much as I did when he was on ship. We have five boys. But the last few days, we found out we have a much bigger family. After the funeral, a procession made up of countless members of law enforcement escorted Rainey as he made one final stop at the Carroll County Sheriff Department on his way to his final resting place. Noah, you have always been my hero. Rest in peace, my son. And so we leave again. I want to let you know the visitation and funeral for jail deputy Dane Northcutt, who was also killed in that same Carroll County crash, is tomorrow starting at 11 a.m. at Solar Baker Funeral Home in Lafayette.